Welcome to AJ Plastic Surgery Center. Today we are going to demonstrate how to do a self breast examination in a bid to early to detect uh, any lump that might be cancerous early enough uh, to initiate a treatment process. So um, um, Dr. Martin Ajuja with me is uh, AC, AC who has been kind enough to be our prop and we are just going to try and really simplify the process of uh, self breast examination because this is supposed to be done by every other woman in, in, in actually in the world. So the first thing, uh, self-breast examination has two components. Okay. First component is what you see, so use your eyes. And the second component is what you feel using your fingers. Uh, idea, uh, you're supposed to uh, undress, uh, go before a mirror, and then the first thing is you put your arms akimbo, arms, arms at akimbo. Mm -hmm and then you move side to side then you move forwards that uh, that, that action will be able to demonstrate a mass or a swelling that is hidden within your breast tissue with that movement or if there's any changes either dimpling or deviation of nipples or there's there's any difference of what you call a symmetry of the nipple if with those action you're not able to pick any changes then you are to lift up your arm, up, down. When you do that, because of the action of muscles supporting your upper limb or the, the, the arms, the hands, then the breast is going to move up and down, and somehow flatten. And with that uh, stretching of the breast, then if there's any hidden swelling or mass, yeah. whether cancerous or not, then it's going to pop out and you're able to see. Uh, the second part of self-breast examination involves uh, the feeling part, whereby you use your three fingers to actually try and detect any mass or any swelling or any abnormality around the breast. So we're going to divide your breast into quadrants. Mm -hmm. So a straight line, then another line across that gives you uh, three quadrants, then the fifth around the nipple and the sixth around the axilla. So we're going to use a, an, uh, an anti-clockwise motion, starting from the inner part, the lower part. That would be one. You try to feel for any swelling. Move to number two. Then you go to three. Then you go to four. Then you go to five around the nipple. And then the, the axilla is easier. Okay. And this, on this part, you try to feel just uh, the tail of your breast and also within the axilla. Because if you have any issue, you'll have what you call lymph nodes, also abnormal swelling. Okay. They are here. Okay.